What's up guys, my name is Matt and it's been a long time since I covered anything Destiny so I decided what better way to come back to Destiny than to try to cover all the changes in patch 2.4 in the shortest time possible. I know you guys don't have time to read the whole thing but if you're the select few that do I've linked the patch notes down in the description but for the rest of you here's the too long didn't read version starting now. So start off weapons got balanced again, fast shooting ARs got nerfed, average shooting ARs got buffed. For pulse rifles one specific one shoots faster, all the ones like Nerwin's Mercy got buffed. For hand cannons nothing really changed, they just display correctly now. For shotguns, the Mobius got buffed, some got a 2% damage increase, and they changed the full auto perk except on the invective. Snipers had a lot changed, some had their damage nerfed, others suck at aiming just as much as you do now, and if you thought there was too much flinch, well guess what, there's more now. On sidearms, they all do the same damage now and are 20-30% to 30 better in PvE. Freeze and rifles had some bug fixes. Rocket launchers were buffed and nerfed. Cluster bomb buffed. Grenades and horseshoes nerfed. And the last weapon type machine guns, the fastest shooting ones got buffed. Let's talk about perks. Take a knee, exhumed, cascade, surplus, grave robber, gorilla fire, unflinching, and firefly were changed. Seven exotics were either buffed, nerfed, or changed. Fabian strategy and direct experiments were buffed, universe remote and thorn were nerfed, and the other three were changed. In addition to all the weapon balancing, they changed public events. The first one drops a lot of stuff if it's a gold completion, and everyone after that drops less stuff, but it's still different than before. Quests are now called progress, and the stuff that drops in the crucible is different, and sterling treasures are now gone, unless you pay for them. They changed some stuff in some game types slightly and prevented some of you cheaters from cheating on certain maps. And finally, the last thing they changed was the UI looks different. Now I could have overanalyzed this stuff and taken 20 minutes to do so, but who's got time for that? As I stated previously, if you want for some reason and want to go read the whole thing in its entirety it's in the description for the rest of you i hope you were quickly informed but that's all i got time for today so i'm gonna get out of here say my name is matt and i'll see you guys next time